Ukrainian general criticized President Zelensky for Zaluzny. Reserve General of the Armed Forces of Ukraine, Serhii Krivanos criticized President Volodymyr Zelensky's desire to dismiss Valery Zaluzny, the commander-in-chief of the Ukrainian Armed Forces. He stressed that Zelensky did not behave responsibly in making decisions. According to him, it is impossible to renew the personnel in the armed forces of Ukraine because it is difficult to find experienced people like Zaluzny in Ukraine. Ukrainian commander-in-chief Valery Zaluzny has reportedly agreed to be Ukraine's ambassador to the United Kingdom and will leave Ukraine within days, lawmaker Yevgeny Shevchenko said. I would like to say that, according to my sources, Zaluzny has agreed to be the ambassador to Great Britain. He is highly likely to go there and we know that those who leave the country as ambassadors are political retirees. None of them has ever returned to their former positions. This is Ukraine's tradition. I hate to disappoint any Zaluzny fans, he said in an interview with Vadim Karasev, director of Ukraine's Institute of Global Strategies. According to the lawmaker, if Zaluzny opts to stay in Ukraine, he has every opportunity to achieve great things in politics after resigning. If he opts to be ambassador, he is not a politician any longer. 100% if he stays in Ukraine and begins to build a political career, he has good prospects. Very good prospects. Shevchenko said, adding that Zaluzny's resignation could be expected on February the 8th or somewhere around there. Ukraine's media and social networks continue speculating about Zaluzny's future. Some say that his resignation stems from the failure of Ukraine's counter-offensive in the summer of 2023 and Zaluzny's political ambitions. A number of foreign media outlets confirmed reports about Zaluzny's dismissal, citing their own sources.